Recent events have shown us that the relationship between government and its citizens is often broken. From the Arab Spring to Occupy Wall Street, citizens worldwide are mobilizing, calling for greater openness, accountability, and responsiveness from their governments. In many developing countries, people are seeking a deeper engagement in public life than simply casting a vote every few years. They want to be included in the decisions that affect their lives. At the same time, many governments have learned that societies work best when government and citizens work together. When citizens are invited to participate in policy discussions and public service delivery, they bring a wealth of ideas, perspectives, and know-how that enhance public programs. Though a concept as old as society itself, the notion that citizen engagement lies at the heart of development has gained tremendous momentum in recent years. Is this a game changer for development? One of the lessons we've learned from the failures of development is that just pumping money into the system is not going to solve the issue. We need to look at governance problems. We have to look at institutional issues. We need to look at how we make institutions more responsive to people. Governments that listen to their citizens deliver better services, and they formulate better policies. Enabling citizens to influence the design, implementation, and monitoring of public policies can result in improved accountability of governments, leading to better development outcomes for all. In this new approach of governance, people actually have a say in determining what the programs will be. They're not passive recipients, but they're active actors for development, and citizen engagement is central in this process. In addition to providing a rich learning experience, this course hopes to catalyze new citizen engagement initiatives around the world. Our instructors, leaders in academia, government, and civil society, provide a broad range of perspectives and real-world evidence to give students a deeper understanding of citizen engagement. Together, we ask and answer the question, is citizen engagement a game-changer for development? We're looking at a wide range of innovations in this course, many of which have been brought about by the ICT revolution. We're looking at things like crisis mapping, the crowdsourcing of constitutions, and we're looking at whether those are really working or not. I think key aspect of the course is that it will be very interactive, allowing for people to contribute their own experiences, ideas, and learn from best practices and good cases from around the world and it's very concrete. We're really excited about this course and we think you will be too.